pretty good deal. Not a bad deal at all. Yeah. Probably pretty cold, I imagine, in an ice rink. I'm probably warmer in there than it was outside, yeah. right? <laughs> that's what I'm well, thinking that's, about. That's not going to be the case the next couple of days. Okay. We've got uh, a nice little warm up coming our way. In yeah. fact, We'll hit 50 probably tomorrow. Nice. So. Wow. It feel, yeah. I mean, it doesn't feel like that today, though, right now. I mean, it's, it's a cold start yeah. this morning. I mean, we got temperatures in the 20s this morning, but we are going to warm up very nicely as the day goes on. And I think we'll see a good amount of sunshine as well. We are starting out with some clouds this morning. So while skies are partly cloudy during the first half of the day, by the afternoon, we should see the skies becoming mostly sunny as temperatures continue to climb. Then as we head towards the evening hours, we're looking just fine. If you have plans to be out and about this evening, it will be a chilly evening as we drop through the 30s and then overnight lows tonight going to drop down into the 20s once again under partly cloudy skies. So as the day goes on, temperatures will climb. We're starting out in the 20s this morning, probably mid to upper 30s by 10 a.m. And then by the afternoon, mid to upper 40s, probably around 48 here in Springfield. But since the average is 34, we're going to be running almost 15 degrees above normal for this time of year. Skies will continue to clear. In fact, I do think we're looking at mostly clear skies as we head through the evening and into the overnight. So your weather headlines, that warming trend will be with us right on into 2023. We are tracking rain, though, to ring in the new year. If you're going to be heading out Saturday night for any of the New Year's Eve festivities, I'll plan on bringing the umbrella with you because it is looking rather wet around here. And even as we head on into New Year's Day Sunday, still going to be some leftover showers that we'll be dealing with during the first half of the day before we dry things out by the afternoon. And then some additional rain chances coming our way mid next week. But again, with temperatures running well above where we should be for this time of year, we are talking about rain and not snow. It's about 48 this afternoon here in Springfield. 50 tomorrow with a blend of sunshine and clouds and then a cloudy start on Saturday morning, but we're dry during much of the daylight hours. It's as we head towards Saturday evening. That's when the rain will begin to move on in. But temperatures on Saturday, upper 40s and lower 50s as that above normal temperature trend continues. But the area of low pressure unfortunately looks like it arrives just in time for New Year's Eve. We are looking at some steady rainfall. Some of the rain could be heavy at times. Here's 8 p.m. Saturday. It looks like it is raining throughout much, if not all, of southern New England. And that will linger into the first part of Sunday. We'll dry things out by Sunday afternoon. Maybe try to work in a little bit of late day sunshine. But at least temperatures are going to still be above normal. 52 for a high temperature Saturday afternoon. And if you are heading out Saturday night, it's not looking all that cold. Maybe upper 30s uh, to around 40 degrees Saturday night. And then Sunday, starting off with the rain in the morning, perhaps some breaks of sun late in the day, but temperatures are still going to be running in the 50s. Satellite and radar, though, we are waking up to some clouds out there this morning, but I think we do work in some sunshine as the day goes on. Sunrise around 718 this morning. By the afternoon, skies do appear to be mostly sunny out there. And then as we head on in to the weekend, the mild air in place, high pressure off the coast, but we're going to be watching this storm system approach for Saturday night and into Sunday. But again, temperatures running well above where we should be, so the precipitation is going to fall in the form of rain. In fact, really no signs of any type of wintry precipitation headed our way over the next 10 days, because even as we head on into the first week of 2023, looks like that above normal temperature trend will continue. Mid next week, though, certainly looking rather unsettled with rain chances possible Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday of next week. Let's check your forecast. Amanda, David, back over to you. Thanks, Don.